Hey guys, it's me, Max Mofo and Kevin the Sheba. Hey, Kevin, say hello. This is one of my cats that does not get enough love. Her name is Kyo. Today we're opening the Zorora box. 12 long inches of Japanese cardboard. Three sexy thunderclap booster packs. Three sexy dragon, probably the last set, booster packs. One exclusive promo, and an oversized, very cool, different artwork, 1000 health, non-tournament legal, mega jumbo, I'm assuming Zorora movie artwork promo card. Oh, let's peel back those flaps. Wow, that opens real easy. That's not my usual dialogue when I'm peeling back flaps. But here we go, the plastic sheath, the giant Japanese back. The Asian innovation. Look at this, there's a second door that opens up. English cards, take note. Minimal damage applied during this method. Okay, I stand corrected, it's it's still a little warped. So here is this Jumbo Butte. Uh, if there's any uh, Japanese fans in the comments, please translate the title of that, because that's clearly not just his standard name. We've got Lugia on the left side there, Sado Wudo for some reason on the right, Eevee and Pikachu tag teaming up to promote the shitty games, all in the latest movie. And here is the beautiful normal sized promo. Number, apparently, Sun and Moon have already had 240 promo cards prior to this. Japan truly is a sweatshop nation. Alrighty, time to see if we can have any more good luck with our packs. It's, it's always a beautiful day when you happen to pull something really good from like three packs out of a box. It's the best feeling ever. We've had it happen maybe twice. Uh, but let's see what we got here. We've got one of the new unit energies. One of my favorite cards from the set so far, at least Doug Trio. Made out of clay, plasticine, whatever. Electabuzz, the seal, one of the 17 kitchen taps. And last of all, wait, no, that is last. What am I on about? All right, let's try this set. I don't think we've done any of these. I have a big box, uh, but I missed out when they came out. Holy shit, Deoxys is back. Uh, he's breaking the sound bar- Oh god, I see something. The sound barrier there. What the hell? That is awesome artwork. Minin and Plusle doing some sort of <laughs> Dragon Ball Z combo. Uh, next we've got Baltoy. Then we've got Whalema. Have not seen him in a while. Uh, have seen Whale Lord literally yesterday. And last of all, Kyogre. Wow, what is this set? Does this have a lot of legendaries? That's sick artwork. I like that a lot. Back to our Deviant Art friend. Let's see what we can get from this one, ladies and gentlemen. Pull it open, one to the front. Follow procedure as always, Lapras on the front there. We've got the transvestite fish. We've got the unnamed goat. We've got the alfalfa diglet. And on the- Ow! Fuck you! Why? Twice! No! God damn it! This is the- Oh man! Ah. <sighs> Guess you should be happy you got a GX, but we already have this piece of fucking snail garbage. Man, why did it have to be one of the ones we already got? We only got like three. Fuck you. <sighs> okay. Can you imagine if you could possibly get two GXs in a box like this? I don't know if it's possible. This is Skitty. Very cute Pokemon. What is this? The cute Pokemon cl club? A cute kitty and a cute piggy. And a uh, focus band or something. And that's the very end card there. Uh, Rayquaza, please, please give us something. I want to see something nice from this set. All right, we've got a bottle of Coca-Cola. We've got Surskit with a very um, kind of cool background there. Uh, wow, like that. A little hacky sack Wismer. Wismer. Uh, we've got the Toking Turtle or Tortoise. And how is this happening? Dude. Three packs from each set, and we fucking pull two GXs. Whoa! What are those? Had to call in a, a class. What? What am I actually looking at, by the way? Last time I checked, this was the visual of a cobblestone house in Minecraft. Now they've just imported it straight into Pokemon. All right, cobblestone temple GX. Glad to add you to the party, my friend. Number sixty of ninety-six. Two GXs. I'm telling you. 
my luck's uh, taking a turn. You know, everything's on a roller coaster. Sometimes you're up, sometimes you're down. Lately, I've been on an up. We've got the Gay Seal Evolution, two bottles of cum, there's the goat, and there is Steelix. Not great on the end. A very short and small box, so you know what that means? It's time to open up an English Forbidden Light. And let's see if it transfers over and we can have some good luck on this one as well. Here is the code card. One, two, three to the front. Get rid of the end card. And let's do it. We've got two swords. We've got a rabbit. We've got a lizard. We've got a... Um... Oh, what the fuck? A seahorse? Jesus Christ. Another rabbit, a frog, a magnet. Literally a fridge magnet. Not bad. We've got uh, two pairs of claws left in the sand. Volcanian prism? Not bad. Love a good prism card. And on the very end, Tyrantrum. Holographic. That's cool. I did not know he was in this. I don't think I've pulled that before. Alright, one holo for one. Let's see if we can do a holo or better again. See, Once I get two non hollows on the back, I'll stop. Let's see how many we can chain together here. One, two, three to the front. Get rid of the steel energy. We've got the two swords again. Okay. This is a bit creepy. The rabbit again. The lizard again. Dude, this is a mirror pack. Okay, we've got a different cat there. Uh, single sword, the bat, the fucking gibble, execute, pyro on the end reverse, and the very end card, one of the shitty non holo, non full art ultra beasts, Zerka Tree. Looks like a sexually transmitted disease. <sighs> Alright, that's one strike. One more strike and we're out. Please don't let me down. One, two, three to the front. Let's see what we got here. We've got a, a fox with a stick, a fucking map, Zygarde, Ben 10 dog, a bug, a blob of cum, a fucking bug, a bug, a cat, um, a Mexican wrestler. <laughs> Reverse! And on the very end, wait, what am I? Oh, I didn't take the energy off. Heat ran. Fuck me! Seriously? I bring in the rule and I just get struck out? Bang, bang? Nah, I don't care. I'm doing another one. I'm bringing in a new rule. If the first two strike you out immediately, you get a, a redeemer. So we're, we're back, okay? I make the rules up here. I'm the captain now. Three to the front. Get rid of that. <sighs> Fat to Denny. Amora. Lady. Block of Ice. Skrelp. Froakie. Crow Gunk. Eggs. Gumi as the reverse. And on the very end. Oh! Okay! Oh fucking K! What are you? Dude, it's Brock's drying pan. I swear I've already got this. Have I pulled this already? M maybe. Dude. Oh, look at the shine on it. Fuck. Number 144 of 131. Secret rare golden item full art, baby. You know this sucker. This kitchen utensil needs sleeving immediately. <laughs> Lucky I kept going. Okay, <laughs> maybe we can, so that chains into the next one. Let's see what we get. Damn, I told you, I'm having good luck lately. I'm on a roll, Brakeson, Mysterious Treasure. I think this is worth maybe a tiny bit, maybe. Uh, shit, dude, does it look like I need this? Scatterbug, Gibble, Rock Ruff, Goomy, Hone Edge, Finnick in Reverse, and on the very end, uh, okay. Okay, look, listen, I am done on that. And now for the very end, it's time to open up one of these weird troll and toad packs that I have. Um, I opened one last time and I was so confused because I remember buying them, but the shit that's written on them doesn't mean anything. It's like rare $6, rare $8, but they, I don't, I don't get it. And they got 15s on the back. It's been so long since I bought them, I... I really don't understand the format or, sorry, the grouping of them because, check this out. So this is just some base set two old Electabuzz. Let's see, we've got Banette. That's from 2015. I don't know why. There's a random first edition Paris from Jungle Set, 1999. We've got a Ralts. We've got a Reverse Machop. 2013. Look at all this random just text on it. I don't understand. 
Does this say $14? I mean, obviously it's not the value of the cards, but I mean, what does that mean? Are they supposed to- Oh wait, this is a big pack here. Oh, I love this Charizard so much! The last one had a Charizard on the back as well. It might be something to do with it. This is such a sick looking card. It's from that- It's from that really cool, weird set in Japan, but they sort of included them as these insert pieces. How sick is this? You've got these cool jewels on the side which come on every card in the set. An incredible hollow foil background, like that is dope. And as you can guess, it's a Christmas special. You've got its actual trainer there in a very weird artwork. And then you've got all these snowflakes on the card. Don't know how those are just sitting on top of a fire beast card like Charizard. And let's see what's inside this, probably just a bunch of... Common stuff. Wow, some really old shit. I don't understand this. Team Magma's Aaron, Hopip, Ghastly, Grovel, Mindfu, and Tangler. Base set? Some weird shit, man. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, I've been posting a lot lately. I know. I'm doing well. But have you seen Kevin's latest Pokemon related post on Instagram? Make sure you give him a follow, kevin.d.shiba on Instagram.com. Alright, guys. Uh, I'll see you when I see you. Probably in two days. I am a scheduled boy now.